Um, Rebecca? Yeah? Yep. Three questions. Okay, go on. Uh, number one, do you want to go to the beach? Yeah. Number two, do you want to go to an island? Uh, Isle of Wight? Yeah. No, uh, no not the Isle of Wight. Uh, number three, should we do an every disuse station? Oh yeah, go on then, we haven't done one of those in a while. We have not. Mm. The Hailing Island branch line marks our 34th episode of the Every Disuse Station series, where we attempt to visit all of the abandoned stations in the UK. So far we've done 353 of around 6,800. So just a little way to go. The Hailing Island branch line is where we're heading today. Built on a budget in 1865, it peels off from the still in use Havant station and heads south toward the beach. Speaking of which, the sun is out, so let's get a wriggle on. Oh my goodness me, I'm excited. Because it's sunny. It, well, number one, it's sunny. It's like <laughs> spring, well into spring now, oh, out of big lockdown. Yeah. Um, well, it's just a little, little lockdown. <laughs> little lockdown. More importantly than anything though, we are now back on the Every Disuse Station Trail. It's only a small Every Disuse Station, it'll be a short, quick, punchy one. Yeah. But we're back on Every Disuse Station, everybody. So yeah, yes, welcome to Every Disuse Station number. Oh God. Oh no, that, that, that I haven't got clue. No idea, 30 something, yeah. maybe. <laughs> Stone Harbour. Okay. And this is about the wildlife. Oh, I haven't smelt sea air in what feels like an age. It is an age. Yeah. Oh, it smells really nice, doesn't it? <laughs> it does. Lovely. Very unique. Um, if you haven't worked out already, we're doing the Hailing Island Branch Line, which is often called the Hailing Billy. And it basically forms part of um, cycle route number two. Yes. For privileged cycle number two. We've never, we've never been that low in numbers no. when we've done cycle route ever. <laughs> All right. So we, we just we just passed Langstone, which is the first stop, the first tick of the day. Langstone station. There's nothing there, is there? Nope. We couldn't find the old station master's house, which apparently burnt down a few years ago. We thought we'd find some remnants, mm. but we couldn't. Maybe they've, we were just in the wrong place for that bit. Yeah, they've got to rebuild yeah. that. We're coming up to now probably the most striking feature of this line, which was the I think viaduct. Well, the viaduct is just as a bridge, but it's just this beautiful structure. Apparently, it was shrouded in concrete from the 1920s, maybe. Yeah, 1920s, early 30s. So that was Langstone Station and the absurdly impressive viaduct just back there. We're going to head a bit further south now and tell you more of the bridge. Bridge, uh, bridge, sorry. We're going to tell you more of the quirkiness of this railway because there's really wonderful little stories about this little line, and that's what we love telling you guys. So uh, we'll see you on the other side of the bridge. Right, so we are now we're now south of the um, south of the bridge. <laughs> we're south of the bridge, which is just over there. We've just taken a slight detour off the track to have a look at the oyster beds. Very exciting, mm -hmm. uh, and we're just talking about the the, the bridge in terms of its. Uh, oh, the historic importance in this part of the railway. Mm -hmm. So they built this line on the cheap. Shocker. London South, uh, London Brighton South Coast <laughs> Railway, and they bought the land off of this guy, the, all these mud flats here, and they, they had this great idea. They didn't have to do compulsory purchase; they were going to use this instead. And of course, it kept on eroding into the sea. And when they came to do the whole board of trade inspection, um, they noticed that a lot of the sleepers were uh, rotten. Yeah, at the very um, beginning of the line is all because yeah. they've been there for so long because it was the start of what they built. It's all rotted yes, away. Yes, and it was rotted away. They had a, an unauthorized uh, level crossing, mm. so. Building on the cheap didn't really help them, they had to fix a lot of these things. And the mud flats here, the way they tried to just build an embankment for a railway, it did work in the end, and they built the line down the west coast. That's some kind of bird horror movie. You mean the birds? Yeah. <laughs> We 
Right, so if you can overhear us over the noise of the birds in the background, we're nearly at Hailing North. So Hailing North was another station on the line south of Langstone. And I think it was extremely busy, especially in the summer months, because obviously London, Brighton and South Coast Railway realised that I think a lot of the traffic was going to be summer seaside traffic. So people from a little bit further north used to pack themselves on the train here, head south down to the beaches. Extremely popular and lots of reports of overcrowding on the trains. So Hailing Island, uh, Hailing Island, Hailing North is probably one of those stops. I, I can just barely hear my voice over the birds. Good luck editing that one. Yeah, that's mad, isn't it? <laughs> Yeah, so we did, we, that was Hailing Island. Uh, no, no, it wasn't. That was Hailing North. North. <laughs> was Hailing North by train, five minutes away from Langstone, and by train, five minutes away from Hailing Island itself, uh, which is where we're going to head now. So we didn't film in a car park because it's a car park, but we'll um, we'll see you at Hailing Island itself. Right, so we're now coming up to the end of the line. We're coming up to Hailing Island Station. Um, which was obviously busy in the summer and not very busy in the winter, basically. Basically, um, yep. I think there's an old, I think we're looking for an old goods shed as well down here. Oh, cool. Maybe. It's been Maybe. reused, reconverted, re something. Reconverted? Yeah. That's the, well, it's not, it's been not. converted and then it's been converted again. Reconverted. Oh, yeah. <laughs> right, it's been, yeah, you see, you're better than words in me. I was never good at English. <laughs> Hailing Island Station, lovely, Rebecca. Well, it's not lovely, but it's kind of lovely in, uh, not lovely, but lovely sense. The fact that it's being reused is great. Yes. It's not just the band. That's the station, that's not the station. No, okay, but it's a part good shed, of what, 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 the infrastructure of what yeah. was the station area. Right, one last request. <laughs> what? Can we go to the beach? Yeah, go on then. Wave. So we made it to Hailing Island Beach, which is lovely. Um, so yeah, hopefully um, you've enjoyed our little every issue station. We've got a lot more every issue stations planned, including tunnels, abandoned railways, obviously viaducts, you name it. Um, a few canals thrown in for good measure as well. Of course. But yeah, hopefully this is us back on the every issue station trail, which we know you love. Um, whoa. Ah, that was a few inches away from my toes. <laughs> right, we'll, uh, we'll see you next week, peeps.